I don't know how this is going to work out, but I want to take you along with me as I finish a song. Because these lyrics, I've had them since the 8th of August last year. So I figured I would take you along. Um, I'm hoping this video won't be too long, so I'll show you like snippets. So here are my me messy notes. Um, so it's basically like, I missed your birthday, do you hate me for it? Had to run away, left you a long time ago, and I'm all better for it. I am now realizing that I just like repeat for it twice, um, but that's fine. Now the thing about these lyrics is that like I've had sort of a melody brewing in my head for a while, but I don't know if it's any good. Um, I don't know, like, I'm gonna get my handy capo. I don't know what key I want to play it in. I don't know what chords I want to go with. So I'm just gonna tinker around for a bit to see if I find anything I like. like that and I also feel like the melody like I have a tendency to keep the melody kind of flat I've noticed and I just don't want my songs to sound too similar so I'm gonna have to scrap that and try something else okay so I think I've come up with like a chord progression that I kind of like um... <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. I like just keeping the same chords going, like it's a four chord song, uh, cause that's easier for me to remember. Honestly, that's why. There we go. Wait, <laughs> what are the chords again? Oh my God, I forgot. Uh no, I can't swear that me by your side. I used to think we were in love for a while, but now I know the truth. I have to switch the page. Or maybe do I want it to be piano based? Like it doesn't have to be guitar. Ooh, um, it's making a really weird buzzing sound. So the thing I do when I think I've got it like sort of figured out with like the melody and stuff is I grab my guitar and then I record myself singing and playing the guitar at the same time and I know that this is not like how you should do it but if I feel like I get a good take I will usually use that take in the final version and then I'll just feel it out I guess if I want to add any other instruments to it like that's exciting just messing around and seeing what i like what i don't like So as you can see, now I've got the guitar and the vocals on the same track, which isn't ideal, but this is how I do it. So now we come to the part of like making it sound not shit, and I'm not great at this, but I love adding reverb <laughs> to my stuff. That's like the best part. So after all of that, like I know I said that adding reverb is like my favorite part, but that's a lie. Oh. My actual favorite part is figuring out how to do harmonies. And this varies from song to song. Um, sometimes I don't feel like adding any harmonies, so then I don't. But on this song, I feel like I wanna add harmonies. I'm generally better at adding harmonies that are like a couple notes above the main melody 
than I am at adding harmonies that are a couple notes lower. Um, I don't know why. It's just easy for me to immediately like like that. Um, hear what a harmony going up would be. But a harmony going down, that's a bit more difficult for me. Um, and as someone with like zero range in their voice, um, that makes it a bit more difficult too. But I'm gonna try to show y'all how I do it. So let's see if I can like make this sound good on the first try. I can't promise anything, of course. <laughs> um, let's see, let me just like feel it out. So here I've got some harmonies. Um, let's see if you can hear this when I play it. I pulled down the dry input on the harmonies uh, for the reverb and what that basically means, I think, <laughs> at least, is that you get more of that um, reverb sound than you get of the actual like singing input voice. Um, I'm not good at explaining. Um, but yeah, I wanted it to sound ethereal in a way. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to try to find a nice keyboard sound uh, that I can put in the background. For example, this one. And I don't feel like that's the vibe of the song, so I'm going to keep on looking. So I think I found the sound that I like. It's a bit eerie. Just listen to this. Like it's a bit off key, but I like it. I think it's gonna fit really well. Now I'm editing some of the like MIDI information because as you can see here, I played the wrong note. It was originally down here. So I just moved it up and voila, problem fixed. So now I got the piano vibe going throughout the entire song, but I'm thinking I need to add something more, something extra that comes in at the end to make it like kapow, you know? Well, I don't know if this is really like a kapow song. It's kind of mellow, um, as my songs usually tend to be, but you know what I mean. I just want it to, I just want something else to come in along with the harmonies um, at the end. Okay, so listen to this. I added a brass section. <laughs> Um, just to try it out, and it's just playing like the root note of every chord. Okay, wait for it. Okay, so what do we think about that? Because I don't know. I think I want to fill it out more, make it the full chords. Because right now the brass is playing the root note twice. So I just put it up an octave. Um, and that's nice and all, but I, but I want that chord sound because it's playing the same note as the piano is, so I'm feeling like the piano gets a little bit lost in there. Okay, so I know you can't really tell from just looking at it like this, but these are the uh, just root notes, these are the chords. And I decided to play the chords an octave down, so I get... Um, what is it called? Because you know in a song when you're playing all the instruments like at the same octave um, and I didn't want that. I wanted it to be split up. So this one is higher up, this one is lower down. Um, yeah, and so we get this. Mistakes. A couple 
teenagers losing the way. I have decided that I officially like the brass sound and I don't know if you can tell but it feels fuller now. Um, it feels like there could be multiple brass players involved um, when in reality it's just me and my MIDI keyboard doing a sort of subpar job. Uh, but I don't know if I want something else. I want some sparkle. I want something light that's maybe like, -na 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 -na. you know, I found a synth sound that I like and okay, I'm going to play it for you and it's going to sound really obnoxious, but I promise I like pulled it down a lot in the mix. So it's just like a bit of high end sparkle, if you will. So yeah, maybe that's the final touch. So here it is. I'm just playing one note and it's doing like arpeggios for me, which is very convenient. So if you listen to it now, you can hear sort of the sparkle in the background, but I didn't want it to be like too overwhelming. What in love with you is bad Teenagers losing the way. So it's just like, yeah, as I said, a little bit of sparkle, I guess you could call it. And I don't really feel like I want to do much more with this song, like at least right now. So I'm gonna do all the stuff that you have to do to make it like listenable. I guess to the best of my ability and um my ability is not like that great but i'm doing my best i'm doing my best um and then i'll come back and probably like insert the song at the end of this video so you can hear what it actually sounds like when it's not coming out of my computer speakers and they're making like this weird creaky sound i don't know why anyway i'll see you soon your birthday do you hate me for it had to let you go left you a long time ago and i'm all better for it blew out candles with me by your side used to think we were in love for a while but i know the truth it wasn't you it was just bad timing Worst mistakes A lost girl With nothing to say I cling to you like you were the only one Now I know it was over Before it began Maybe I fell but no one caught me Was I too young or too naive? Never even called to say I'm sorry But I'm wondering if that's on me It was just bad timing Worst mistakes A red-headed boy Not knowing his way The two of us weren't the best match Were you in love? I didn't dare to ask staying in a week hiding on the sheets I forgot to think about what I needed lonely in your company did you ever truly see me look at me now I'm not bleeding it was Bad timing, the worst mistake Don't know how I was fooled into thinking I was in love with you It was just bad timing, worst
Shores and sticks A couple teenagers Lost in the way If we ever meet again I wonder what would happen then I missed your birthday And I'm all better for it So yeah, that was like the process of like not writing the song but because I already had it written but like coming up with everything else and I don't know, I hope this has been fun for you because it was fun for me. Um, I hope you like the song, I hope you like the brass section. <laughs> um, yeah, this will probably come out on streaming services at some point. Uh, but of course, I'll let you know beforehand. Bye! Love you!